Today we're gonna to be talking about making the cut. It's on Prime Video and it is like this amazing mashup of television and awesomeness, fashion, and Amazon. It's like, ugh, it's the best thing ever. So the coolest thing is that it's a great show with Heidi Klum and Tim Gunn, my favorites. Um, also, I wanted to share with you basically how it works. So what happens is every week they come out with an episode. Um, the first week they came out with two episodes, so you were able to shop two different designers, the winners, see who wins, and then the design is immediately available on Amazon. And it's so great because you're able to shop what's on the runway. It's so singing cool, and I wanna show you what I've gotten so far. Spoiler alert, there are spoilers ahead. So the first episode has Gary Graham as the winner and he is like, his designs are amazing. Basically what he does is gets like rugs and puts them as part of the dress. And I was like, how is this going to work? You know, how it's not going to be a rug, obviously, because that fabrication and that like detail is not going to be possible. Um, like through Amazon, like on a production basis. Like how are they gonna do this? I don't know, but they did it really well. So they printed it on, it's part of the fabric basically. Um, and I was like, they're not gonna do like the cool way that he like, basically they called it like snatching in the waist. I was like, are they gonna actually be able to do that? How are they gonna do that? And they did it, wow. So let me show you here. They put the waistband starting at the shoulders and then that way you can wrap it around your waist. It looks fantastic and it brings the eye into the waist area. I love it and I highly recommend it. Also this like puff sleeve is fantastic. Um, what they put in here was this little ridge so that it kind of puffs out when you wear it. Super flattering. I'm definitely going to be keeping this dress. I love the length. I love that it brings the waist in. It's great for curvy petite women because it's all about bringing the eye into the waist. It's just not something that I normally would like go for, but wow. I really liked it on the runway and I wasn't sure on the web. When I saw it on the Amazon website, I was like, eh, I don't know if I'm going to like this. We'll see. And when I got it, I was like, wow you know, the green and blue together and then this beige. It's super fall and perfect. Love it, love it, highly recommend. If we haven't met yet, I'm April Go Lately. I love helping petite curvy women look fantastic. If you like my videos like this one, please like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the bell because I do two videos per week. Yes! Spoiler alert for episode two. <laughs> Okay, in this episode, Joshua Skakeri, he's based out of London, won the Making the Cut episode. So cool. I'm super impressed by him and wow. So his new, um, he had a design line called something else and now he's decided to call this one Love Hero, which I think is a great name, it's super fun. Um, with this episode, they like went out and took photos of like the ocean and they were doing like resort wear, which I love resort wear, it's so fun. Um, you know, I live in Florida, so it's definitely a thing for me. I'm all about the resort wear um, because basically, you know, sometimes our life is a little bit resorty, um, or at least we'd like to think it is, you know? Um, anyway, with him, he like took photos um, near the ocean and his uh, kimono, I think this is a kimono or a duster, um, basically has photos of like the ocean in here. This is the ocean. Um, and then the power lines, and it's kind of an intersection. What he said was that it was an intersection of, um, you know, the, the environment and real life. So like the, obviously the power lines is a real life thing. The cool thing about the power lines, they kind of act as a kind of a stripey detail. It's a fun mashing of prints, which I love prints, so it was nice to see like this mashup of it. So on the show, it's styled and he made it with a pair of like palazzo type pants that are high waisted, super cute. I don't know if they're necessarily work for a curvy petite figure because they're so wide that they might be just like bringing the attention downward. And I'm not uh, always a big fan of that. Um, so anyway, I tried out the kimono. Um, it's very nice. It's a polyester, 100% um, polyester. And it kind of feels like it's, um, 
I don't know, like silky maybe might be like the right choice that it's supposed to feel like, but it is polyester, which means that it doesn't breathe very well. So I feel like during the summertime, I wouldn't be necessarily wearing something polyester. I would probably be wearing linen or cotton, something that breathes, especially something this long. Um, I just think the, the fabric choice wasn't the best choice, but I still think it's beautiful. Um, loving the prints. Um, I might be sending this one back. I'm like on the fence about it. Like I said, I haven't worn it outside yet. I've only worn it in my living room, so I'm not sure. You know, I might turn down the AC and see how I'm feeling in it. But in general, I know that when it's hot outside, I don't really like wearing fabrics that don't breathe that well. Anyway, so I paired the kimono with this super cute dress that's a racer back. Uh, dress from Wild Meadow. It's a new brand from Amazon and I'm totally loving their look. It's like a good, good length, super comfortable, lightweight, and a little stretchy. So Joshua, in winning episode two, he actually also won um, a collaboration with an influencer and he chose the influ influencer Swede. And basically they get together and they're doing an Amazon the drop uh, collaboration. The drop is very, very interesting where you're able to shop influencers, you know, clothes, not clothes, their designs. Um, and you get like a, a time limit on it. It's usually like, I think like 30 hours maybe. I can't remember the exact amount of time that they allow it, but it, it popped up on my phone. I get, if you wanna sign up, you can actually sign up for like notifications when these drops happen from Amazon. So I got a notification that Love Hero was having a drop. So I immediately ordered the uh, the shorts. They're super cute. Um, he has a blazer and two pairs of shorts and I think a few other pieces. Um, and I ordered like the pink blaze, the pink shorts. So sinking cute. Spoiler alert for episode three. Don't go any further. So in episode three, they were making a wedding dress. It's super cool. It's a uh, Josh Skakeri and Lucy Burchard. It's a beautiful modern wedding challenge. It came out with this beautiful pleated dress that definitely could be worn as a wedding dress, as a short wedding dress that's like a minimalist bride look, or just a regular white dress that you could rock, you know, whenever you feel like rocking a white dress. Um, I think it's a fun look, and I love that there is like a little bit of a subtle print to it. Um, I also like the double V, the V in the back, and then the V in the front makes it super flattering. Um, and the straps that are thick enough that you can wear a bra with it, which is awesome. Um, the price point is really good for a wedding dress, $99.90. That such a great deal. I also love the fact that they're showing on the website, you know, different women, different body types wearing the dress and different skin colors. It's just awesome that they're very inclusive. I love the collaboration of Amazon and making the cut. It's so cool. You're able to shop it so quickly and get it in the mail like that. It's so much fun. Um, I wanted to share with you my Amazon spring favorites here. There's a ton of stuff that'll go from season to season that you will absolutely fall in love with. Thanks so much for watching. Thank you.